hello YouTube and it's Dom here today from Dom Planet and today we're going to be doing a PS2 emulation tutorial on Windows 10. I will be showing you guys how to download the emulator itself and how to get games and how to set up the emulator. So without further ado let's go ahead and get into today's video. So first of all you want to head over to your favorite web OS, mine being Google and the first link I will give you guys is 7-zip. This is a file extraction tool. Um, it lets you extract 7-zip files, RAR files, and everything like that. Um, I already have this downloaded, so I will not be needing to download it, but you can find the latest version underneath Alpha, and depending on your operating system, you'll need either the 32-bit or the 64-bit. Um, you can find out which OS system type you have by going over to your settings underneath system go to about and it should say it underneath system type as you can see I have the 64-bit operating system so I would need this download right here again link will be in the description below the second link I will give you guys as the emulator itself the emulator is called PCSX2 and the latest version on Windows is 1.6.0 as of June 5th, 2021. Just go ahead and click over here. Open it whenever it is done installing. And then I like to do the portable installation where you make a folder on the desktop, name it PS2 and then go ahead and click next on here you can untick the desktop shortcut go ahead and browse to that PS2 folder and go ahead and install it once it's done installing you can go ahead and open it up for the first time uh, this is the language selector I use system default which is English here you can configure the graphics and everything I just leave that alone right here you can configure your controller go underneath pad 1 and you can click on quick setup I use an Xbox controller to play games on my computer And once you're finishing setting up the controller, you can go ahead and click on Apply, and then OK. This is the sound plugin, the DVD plugin, the USB plugin. All of this can basically stay the same. Now, here is where you select a BIOS file for the PS2. Again, I will leave this file in the description down below. You can just go ahead and click on Download right here complete the capture once the capture is completed it should go ahead and download a RAR file right here and once that's done downloading you can go ahead and go inside of this folder and then it gives you a bunch of PS2 BIOS files. The one I like to use is this 2.3.0 American file. You can choose whichever one you want depending on the country and version you need. You want to go ahead and go into the PS2 folder, go into the BIOS folder and go ahead and drop this BIOS file down below. You can click on refresh list and as you can see it lists the BIOS file in here. Click it and go ahead and select finish. And then voila, there you go. You can access the emulator now. You can go into the config and mess with emulation settings, the memory cards, and plugins. 
I just like to leave everything at the default. I will go ahead and show you now the third link, how to download games. Now do be advised, I will give you a description. If you get on this website and download games, it is technically illegal. And it is illegal to download ROMs in general online. But it is not illegal to dump your games and you can put them in the emulator itself. So it is highly advised to dump your games, put them in the computer, dump the ISO yourself. But this is going to be in the description if you do not have that. Now I'm not going to show you how to download it because that's illegal, but it is there for your use. So to go ahead and launch a game, you'll go ahead and select boot ISO full, click on where you have the game, mine's on my desktop, bully, and go ahead and open it. You can go through this, select the language, select the time zone, daylight savings time, yada yada yada. Settings is complete. And then now the game should start. And as you can see, it booted just fine. And that's it guys, that's all you need to know to download PS2 and play PS2 games on Windows 10. Um, I hope you liked the video. Um, if you did, drop a like, that helps out the channel a lot. Comment down if you have any questions. And make sure to subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any of my videos. And uh, on the road to 4,000 hours of watch time, I appreciate everybody that watches the channel. It helps out a ton. Looking forward to going to make money on YouTube. That's a really big accomplishment that I've been working on for a few years now. So, again, thank you. Everybody be safe. Have a good night. And peace.